when you're working with radicals, it's important to be able to add and subtract radicals. To add and subtract radicals, you have to concern yourself with like radicals. Like radicals are radical expressions that have the same index and the same radicand. Uh, much like like fractions having a common denominator, uh, like radical expressions need to have the same index and the same radicand. Um, you can use the distributive property to add and subtract like radicand. So let's look at this first example where the directions are to add or subtract if possible. We should recognize here that the radicand or the index is 2. And we notice that the radicand is the same, xy. So we can use the distributive property to factor out the common factors, leaving in parentheses 7 plus 3 the square root of xy on the outside of the parentheses. Of course, that is multiplication there. 7 plus 3 is 10. Thus, in simplest form, the original expression is 10 square roots of xy. Another way to say that would be 10 times the square root of xy. In part b of example 1, we notice that these two radicals are the cube root, but the radicand is different, therefore we cannot add these because the radicand is different. So remember, when adding or subtracting radical, radical expressions, they need to be like radicals. And to be like, they have the same index and the same radicand. 